conversation with Ink Boy. But to Ink Boy's surprise, well, he was looking forward for a feature like the music video because when it comes to the audio, it's already in it's there. Already out, yes. yes, and it, for me, it's a good tune, basically. Yes, it is. Yes, but this past Monday, mm -hmm. somebody released the video and Ink Boy was nowhere to be found. Yeah. So the guy was like literally pained because I was on the song with you. Yeah. Why are you shooting a music video and you didn't even call me or even mm -hmm. alert him that you're shooting it so I can mm -hmm. come on it? Mm -hmm. And uh, it, it brought a lot of tantrums on social media. Yeah. So first of all, let's get some of the reactions or the tweets that Ink Boy brought on a Twitter, basically. Sure. All right, so first of all, Ink Boy said, Sincerely, I know this might come off weird and people will tag me ungrateful, but I put blood and sweat into every song I deserve, and I deserve to be shown genuine love, but it's sad him at Sakode. I literally beg for every small chance to show myself, but it they decline. Mm. Okay, he goes ahead to say, I begged like I was going to cry to be at the Rockaholic, but that didn't work. Sure, sh uh, sure, I can't be entitled, but I just heard about the One Million Cities video three days ago, and his heart's broken. Didn't even know it was gonna drop today. Just saw people tagging me low, mm. and it goes on and on. He also said, I get mad love for King at Sako. Dear Allah knows this from my heart, but why don't I ever, uh, why don't I ever get small chance? I appreciate. Uh, putting me on the record but you're like uh, a dad to me treat me like a son too i'd be independent you know how bad i need this if not now then never mm. wow some uh, of the tweets are harsh yes, in a certain yes. way if, if you want to make your point i feel like you should be able to make your point mm. without attacking him maybe of you course. should go straight you definitely when the song was coming out or when you guys were about to release the song mm. If, if you sent your verse to him, I'm sure it passed through a setting channel and so the you have to exactly so if you if you feel like something has isn't right, I feel you should go to the right channels and not come on social media and make Sakodia look bad. But then again, people are saying that mm. Sakodia tries to outshine up and coming art and yes. all of that. But but he also has his reasons. Of course. And, and even with what you're saying, mm -hmm. I understand you perfectly mm -hmm. well. But let's mm -hmm. take it from this perspective as well. Before we even put someone on the stone, mm -hmm. let's say he had this contract with a guy. Mm -hmm. Like, was it on a paper notice? Yeah. Was it a contract? Mm -hmm. Did they have a base on the royalties that is going to make out of all of this? Yeah. Or it's just like, okay, so I want to be on the song. So, mm -hmm. Sack, please, can you just feature me? And Sack was like, okay, just hop on it. If there's nothing like paperwork, then you shouldn't blame Sack in the first place. Exactly. Because according to the tweet, mm -hmm. He begged like a small boy. Of course. So there's no contract here. Uh huh. So it's like Sakodia just said, okay, let me just do this with this. And guy. even you guys too should understand that sometimes when an artist makes a song, first of all, they don't even think about the music video. Mm -hmm. They first look at the audio, how well it's do at exactly. the market space. And then yeah. when it goes well, they then further come with the music video. So yeah. let's say maybe in his plans, he didn't even think about, you know, coming out with mm -hmm. the music video. Mm -hmm. Or maybe even if he had the plans, he weren't part of it. That's true. Look at, you know, um, Countryside. Mm -hmm. We saw, we listened to the song for several, several times, times before even the music the dropped. Yeah, then, exactly. um, the Labadi too with King Promise, the yeah. same thing. Yeah. So maybe he felt like, you know, this one, maybe the numbers are not coming mm -hmm. up and it wasn't part of my plan. Mm -hmm. So it is like, it happens. People yeah. even do music and it doesn't even come out to the first place. Yeah. Sakura himself for some time said like he has about like over 800 songs that is yeah. in there that he hasn't yeah. been brought up. Mm. Because maybe time factor, mm. availability, yeah. maybe the money post and pre-production and, and everything. And even, like it's a whole thing together. Yeah, even looking at the video itself, mm. it, di it didn't look like he shot it in, in Ghana. It's not in Ghana. Yeah, maybe where yeah. he shot it, there were, there were some limitations. Of course. Only few people could go there. Exactly. But let's take a, a 